You know, every family story, every parent's story is so different. We hear from parents who say things like, I have skipped meals for three days to ensure my kid could take a lunch to school today, because that's important to me. We hear from parents who say, I can't function at work anymore because I am not eating enough to make sure that my kids have enough time, because I don't want them to be hungry. When I think of the experience of parents, and if we, if we talk about everybody needs something, I think the same is true for parents. Every parent needs something. And some parents just need help with having food for their kids. Food security is having consistent access to nutritious food as much as you need when you need it. 20.3% of Albertans experienced food insecurity in the last year. That is higher than any other province in the country. 21.6% of kids in Alberta experienced food insecurity in the last year. If you look on your block, there are five houses on your block. One of those families experienced food insecurity in the last year. This is an experience that literally hundreds of thousands of Albertans are having. We focus on kids because we think there's something really powerful that happens in childhood and when you have what you need to flourish, to do better than survive, to be your best, that you can, that you people who are set up for success can succeed and do succeed and, and are amazing in their own way. And so we believe, we know, we work to um, ensuring that all kids have access to the food they need because we believe that it's critical to, it's critical for all of us to have kids that are healthy and strong and safe and cared for. So for kids who need food, we can just give them food. That shouldn't be any more shameful than needing help with math or needing a teacher to teach you things in school. For us, being able to say to kids and, and talk to kids about and build our experience around, it's just food. Everybody needs it and if you bring your food from home and you buy it at the cafeteria and I get it delivered by someone else, that's okay, we can still eat together. It's just food.